We are here at the Pinhoti Trail uh, Flag Mountain. Beautiful place here. Uh, we're starting the section one today. I have a Kenneth here. Talk about this. Uh, what are we doing today, Kenneth? So we're going to do section one today, Pinhoti. It consists of uh, a couple road sections, some forest roads. So uh, this section, section one is pretty diverse. Uh, some hills and some lowlands, some asphalt, some fire roads. Uh, it's a real, real nice area. So Have you ever done this area? I've done from the Flag Mountain trailhead to the first road crossing and, and back. Got it. I've never been to this area. This looks beautiful here. We're gonna keep keep going and, and figuring out what, what this trail is all about, correct? Yep, yeah, we're gonna enjoy the day. We're at the Flag Mountain cabin area. Very nice area here for your lodging needs. Hi, I'm Craig Myers. I'm the caretaker here at Flag Mountain. Um, it's a beautiful place. Um, right now, the, the, the tower is not open due to construction, but the cabins are open. Uh, we rent them out on weekends. Just give us a call. And it's just a beautiful place up here. How many cabins it's, do you have here? But, uh, there are four cabins here, but right now we're only renting out two. Okay. And we rent them out on Friday and Saturday nights. Got it. Uh, two night minimum. And there's one seventy dollars, the other one's ninety dollars. Tell us about this mountain. Um, I'm I'm new to this mm -hmm. area. I have done Penhody area north side of here, but tell us about what's what what we had to look at the south side of um, this Penhody. No, on the Penhody, the uh, yeah, just um, Flag Mountain is the the last mountain over one thousand feet of the Appalachian chain. It's at one thousand one hundred and fifty five feet and it's sort of like the beginning of the Appalachian Mountains. And then the, the eighth, the Pinhoti, follows basically that, that, that route that all the count. way up to uh, Springer Mountain. And it's the 377 mile trail. Uh, Alabama, in my, in my opinion, is the nicer section. <laughs> <laughs> we we uh, agree that. Yeah, uh, gen, you know, gently rolling hills, you're in the woods, not a lot of road walking. Uh, some here at the beginning, but other than that, it's just uh, be it's beautiful. Great. Thank you. Thanks for thanks for your time, and um, we enjoy this mountain. And thanks for taking care of this place. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you. We arrived to the Seltzer area, uh, guys. Here, I actually have never been to uh, through run and seen a Seltzer, so this is probably the first time for me. Let's check it out. It's uh, very primitive. Uh, there's there's some chairs here. Uh, no lights. There's a logbook here, and somebody le left a lighter here that'll be useful. But basically, very primitive, better than sleeping outside, I guess. There's a tarp. I guess you're supposed to clean it out. But interesting, I've never been to see anything like this for me personally. I know if you run through hike through run, you'll see things like this more often. One of the best part here is basically uh, you can see the river down there. As you can see, the trail will go that way. I will head it that way, but definitely a good place to stop. Let's go check out the river. Guys, we made it through the first trail section here. Kenneth, how was the, how was the trail the, so far? Uh, it's a little overgrown in some spots. Uh, a lot of off-camera running and, uh, well, so-called running. It's not very running. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's a wonderful trail, yeah, isn't it's, it? It's, it's a nice place, nice yeah. trail. We were kind of, we had some anxiety coming through here because we were thinking there would be a lot of snakes and stuff. Yeah, and we didn't see not the first, no snakes. And we haven't picked up any ticks. I, mean, I kind of continuously no looking for it, but we'll have to wait till the end. But definitely, this is a great section. This is his home. I think we we get, we get on the other side of that tree, bypass him. He's venomous. We're about uh, 12 and a half, a little bit more than that from the start. A very nice camp area. Uh, a lot of looks like uh, people do camp here. Water, running water here. Very primitive style of camp camp area, and uh, very nice. It looks like uh, if you're hiking through it, probably it's a good good place for you to stop. See, when you see this double double mark, I was told that you're about to turn. So that's that's usually what you want to look at it. Uh, we kind of got lost earlier. We didn't pay attention. As you can see, there's only one mark here. We made it here uh, to the mailbox. When you uh, through run, you got to run from mailbox to mailbox or the or, or the section to section. This is 
This is a pretty long section that we came through, about 21 miles. Right now we're 17 and a half. You know, this is tough uh, running summertime. We, we saw a snake uh, and then, um, and of course, uh, there's a lot of water crossing. Uh, if you are carrying uh, water filtration, water purification, that's a really good. That's what you want to do. If you want to run during the summertime, our mistake is we do not have a water. We, we, whatever we carry, we thought it's going to be enough but not enough for the heat that we are facing today. But, but we'll make it to the road now. Hopefully we'll find somebody to give us some water. <laughs> Kenneth, you have any, any input so far? Uh, no, it's just a long, hot day. Uh, you know, short of water supplies. Uh, it's deceiving. There's more hills out here than, than what we initially thought. So, uh, so yeah. It's a tough section, but, but real pretty. Pretty trails here. Yeah, definitely. Uh, we're thinking it's a 2,500 uh, feet climb. I think it's going to be more yeah, than that. We'll, we'll, we'll see at the end. I will talk about that. But definitely, it's, uh, it's much different uh, than uh, the last section we did, one and two, for sure. And this trail is um, this variety. That's what we noticed. Up and down, creeks, hills, downhill, uphill, so on. A road, so <laughs> anything you can find. So definitely. Yeah. We came out of trail now. We're back to the road section, final section of this uh, uh, section one. Uh, finally, we're here. We we have been hearing this car, uh, this highway all along. Now finally, we're here to see the car. So, so look, looking forward. Uh, thanks to the gentleman who gave us some water because we, as I said that earlier, we ran out of water. So so here we are. Last stretch. Guys, we just stopped by here at uh, Mr. Ken Cooper's house. Angela here. She's brave enough to come outside and say hello to us. Uh, strangers <laughs> are just passing through. You know, we are. Uh, we needed some water, and uh, it's been a tough day for us. But definitely, thanks for all the things you think, things you all do, uh, running, taking care of the trail. So thank you. We appreciate y'all. Here you. we are. Kenneth, this was a struggle for us, huh? Yeah, it was. It was wait. almost the seven hours of running hiking and I think it's like we took us about almost eight hours of total time yeah tell about your tell us tell us this about our experience we're back to Dollar General by the way guys look at that yeah, we're, we're finished running out of water so it was a, a lot slower than we anticipated a lot harder a few more hills than what we uh, we expected and trail conditions were a little rougher than we we planned for but real pretty trails uh, just a hot day. We struggled, like I said, running out of water. It's on us. It's uh, part of our, our where well, we failed at planning going into it. So, but we're done. Section one's complete. Got 21 and a half miles. Uh, six and a half hours moving time, which is pretty slow. But Like what Kenneth said, we are done, done. Uh, section one. This has been a pretty interesting uh, struggle. And a uh, gentleman we, we met, uh, one point he made is, is if it's, everything's easy, you won't remember anything. But for sure, we'll remember section one. <laughs> this has been a great struggle. And I'll put more videos and audios out there about this uh, wonderful trail. Thanks to all, all the volunteers who, who maintain these trails. And, um, and great to, be, to finish section one, two, and three. Onward to four next. I ran about uh, 10 miles, guys. Uh, thinking about the coke at the Dollar General. Uh, as we ran out of drinks, I was thinking like, oh, once I get to Dollar General, I'm gonna get a Coke. So here I am in the Dollar General, got my Coke, and I'm gonna have to do some dance. Be a good